Hey, it's Reed Fleurin here, and I want to thank you for taking action on the One Page Resource Facebook Cheat Sheet. Now, before I dive into how this works, let me tell you a little bit about why this is useful for you. Well, this is designed for three or four different types of people. The first person it's designed for is the Facebook newbie who hasn't really done Facebook, maybe has an account, maybe doesn't have an account. It's designed for them to get up and running and figure out Facebook fast by being able to search all these different resources and getting a lot of free training on Facebook. The next person this is designed for is someone who's maybe writing a blog post or creating a video or they're creating some piece of content related around Facebook and they want to quickly look up things that people are asking about Facebook and things that people are talking about regarding Facebook and like re latest news results about Facebook so they can tailor their blog posts and their videos about Facebook and give the most up-to-date most accurate information that people actually want to know about. The third person this is for is for the Facebook expert. Maybe you're someone who makes a living off of Facebook or you teach Facebook marketing. This is for you so you can keep abreast of all the changes. And the fourth person this is really for is for someone who is maybe an affiliate marketer and maybe they have a list or a blog or some sort of website or they want to just start marketing Facebook related products. Well you can start finding products about Facebook and you can get your affiliate links and get approved for them and start marketing these Facebook products on the internet. So let's go through with that mindset and figure out how you can benefit from this. Well, first things first, if you're on a PC, you can press the control button and click on these links and they'll open up in a new window. If you're on a Mac, it's the command button and you click on the link. So I'm on a Mac right now, so I'm going to click the command button and click on a link. So let's say I want to keep up to date with some news about Facebook. I'll do that and a new window is going to tell me some of the news about Facebook. I'll go back to the cheat sheet. Maybe I want to search maybe the warrior forums for some posts and see what people are talking about regarding Facebook. So here you go. It gives me some of the most recent results about Facebook. Here we've got you know over 8,000 um, posts about Facebook alone. That gives you some ideas. Now let's look at maybe blog posts that have come up. Here's some of the more popular blogs and some of the, the most recent things that we're talking about Facebook. Now we could go and search Twitter for example and see what people are saying about Facebook on Twitter. We could search um, BuzzSumo. That's a, a very useful way to keep up to date of some of the most shared content about Facebook. I like searching Amazon because this gives you a lot of useful information. For instance, this is giving me some, some apps and it's defaulted to that. But sometimes when you search for different things, you can get um, various books and things. So I'm going to switch back to any category because it just defaulted to, to apps because it knew what Facebook was. I'm going to click on books. And here, my Facebook for seniors. I'll click on that. And you can see it's got a lot of different information here about the book. So I'm going to look at the book here. I'm going to see the table of contents. Well, here's things that people are looking to know about Facebook. I mean, it's in a book that's got 65 reviews on it. It's probably sold quite a few copies for it to be showing up so highly. Like it's number eight in books regarding social media. So this is obviously selling very fairly well. It's in basically the top 13,000 books in the, the whole world right now. Uh, another thing I really like to do is search YouTube because this gives you a lot of videos that you could, could use. There might be, <laughs> there's some kind of strange ones here on this one, but you know, Facebook is a pretty huge thing. I mean, there's 121 million Facebook videos on YouTube alone. I like searching for different products related to Facebook, so I'm going to click on Warrior Plus here. And it is searching for things that are related to Facebook. So these are all different Facebook products that you could promote. Now you could do the same thing for ClickBank or JVZoo, and you could find a bunch of different products that are selling right now. I like searching Yahoo Answers to see what people are asking about Facebook. 
So these are potential product ideas or um, content that you could create. I also like Google Groups for doing the same thing. Yahoo Groups are pretty similar. The searches for, for some information that you might find useful. I like searching the For Dummies books because this searches all the For Dummies books, you know, the thousand or so books they have, and it looks for the most relevant things. So they have 76 Facebook-related books that they, they sell, 2,660 results of Facebook content that you could, you know, learn some stuff from. There, I like Quora. This is a good resource for finding out questions that people are asking. I like easing articles because that gives you some content you could put on a website. And you can copy and paste that content and put it on your own website. I like Fiverr because this gives me, you know, maybe I need some help with something related to Facebook. I can just hire someone to do some Facebook work for me and, and they'll do it. And usually it costs five dollars. So it's, it's, it's pretty cool. Um, you know, there's quite a few different different resources here. I think you get the idea of how this works. It's very useful, it's a very quick, very easy way to search 40 different resources that would take you many hours to do by hand and this just lets you quickly get up and running, saves you time, saves you money, and you get a lot of free training, a lot of information on the internet, and you also find out exactly what people are looking for so you can create high quality information yourself either to put on a blog or something that you might sell in the future. So thanks for taking a look at the Facebook Cheat Sheet and I look forward to seeing you on the members area.